Hi everyone and welcome to my new channel Dam and Me Stress Free. Now today's video, my very first video will be sharing all of my stash. Now I quickly will show my whip that I'm working on and then I'm going to have to pop you up on the tripod and get into all this. Yes. Now before I move all of these goodies, just a little bit about myself. I've actually been on YouTube for three years. I think it's about three years and I started off with my colouring channel which is still very very much active but I thought instead of uploading diamond painting videos to that channel I'm going to make a separate thing all by itself for my diamond me stress free. I thought I could link them both together. Now I am from England, I am 34 years old, I have got two children, one dog and one husband. <laughs> <laughs> one husband, I should mention that. One annoying husband sometimes. I don't know. I love him. I love him, my Danny, but yeah, don't boys do your editing sometimes. <laughs> but yeah, this is going to be my stash video. I will show you very quickly. This is my favourite one, my Drogon that I've not started yet. I've recently moved into this house only two weeks ago. And I've got one room in my art room that's completely bare and it's waiting for this bad boy to be put up. I cannot wait. But I'd already promised my son that I would work on that Galaxy one. But I'm out of breath. I'm out of breath. Uh, I will move all this out of the way and go through all of my uh, diamond paintings. I do actually keep as well a diary and I only started that when I seriously started diamond painting. So I have got some diamond paintings that I've finished and I've gifted and I haven't actually got the, the little stickers unfortunately. Uh, hey ho, it's just one of them things. So, let's just jump straight into it. So these first couple I actually got sent by the company. Like I mentioned, I do have a YouTube channel already. I will have that linked in the description just in case you just want a little bit of a noser. But these two were sent. And I got this one purposefully. I'll take it out to about here because I don't want to move the diamonds. I got this one purposefully to do for my sister. And I do still intend on doing it. I do think that she'd really like it. She's got a tattoo that looks very, very similar to this. And this is from Spell Queen. Now I have actually got a finished one of Spell Queen up on my wall. And it's my colouring um, YouTube thumbnail. Although I recently changed it, which is a bit silly, so I might change it back. <laughs> you know, you try new things and then you think, oh, I shouldn't have done that, I shouldn't have done that. Uh, and I believe the next one is a dragon one. Now, if you've come across my colouring channel, you will know that I am dragon mad. But if you're new here, then yes, I love anything dragons. So at this very moment in time, there's an epic programme on TV called House of the Dragon, which I am thoroughly enjoying. So we've got this bad boy, and I'm looking forward to starting this. And it's not an absolutely massive one as well. It's, it just cuts off here, so it shouldn't take me too, too long to actually do this. And it's around. I did notice, uh, let me just roll this up then, carry on talking. I did notice when I was uh, taking out all of my stash, I don't have many round diamond paintings. Now, I do like the look of square ones better, but in saying that, I like to alternate. So I like to do a round, and then a square, and then a round, and etc, etc. And I'm really, really, really low on the rounds. Really low on the rounds. Actually, I'm going to have to take my cardio off, it's too warm. And I've just put it on as well. <laughs> just put it on, but it's too warm. Right, so yeah, I'll count the rounds. I didn't check what that one was. Let me just have a quick little nozzle. Am I going to be able to see? That one is a square. So we've got one, one round, one square so far. Where am I going to put these? I'm running out of room. Uh, a newest purchase. This one is flower... Shall I bother taking these out? Because if you've done diamond painting, you've probably, you've probably seen seen them, haven't you? I'll take the Drogon one out just to show you how epic that one is, just in case that you've not seen it. But this is Flower Market Girl, and I, I was aware of this artist before even starting diamond painting. If you've coloured, you know who Hannah Lynn is, and that's uh, who this artist is. And that one is around 
Don't let me forget as well to so show you my little planner. So that's two rounds and one square. And then we've got Crocodoc Baby. Now, I bought this one and it's a square. I bought this one because it was on sale. I'll show you the ones that I bought on sale. And I love the look of the Mandy Manzello diamond paintings, but I've got to be honest, I have finished one and I got halfway through and I just wanted it to end. I just wanted it to be finished and done with and I did push through and get it finished. And I feel terrible for saying that because I know that there's so many fans of hers out there. I love her art, but for some reason I found it difficult to do a diamond paintings. So, but I have got it in my collection now. And I didn't say the sizes of the other ones. But this one is a 56 by 91. Let me check the... And that Hannah Lynn one was a 51 by 71. So we're on two frames. Oh, I've got them all falling everywhere. <laughs> um, intimate, infinite, imp, English Deborah. Infinite wisdom. Now this is some cute little owls and again I got this in the sale and I'm really really glad I got this one in the sale so I'll definitely definitely do it and that one is another square and it is 66 by 51 so it's large but it's not like overwhelming large uh, another square and again I've got this one in the sale uh, Demure Wisdom and this is a 51 by a 69 with a picture of a line. I think this one's going to be really, really bonny when it's done. Looking forward to starting that one. Uh, in hindsight now, the only reason that I'm happy that I've got this is number one because it's pink and number two because it's around and I got this one in the sale as well and it is Sleeping Beauty. If I would order again, I probably wouldn't have ordered this one because it does look like there's a lot of confetti around here. I like a mixture. Hello Rollo. And that's a 51 by 66. I'm not crazy, I'm not talking to myself, I've got a dog. <laughs> I've got a chihuahua called Rollo. So that is two, three rounds. I've got another round here. It's making me have to be a liar this, but I swear that there's more squares than round. And I got this one in the sale as well, and this one is uh, Jasmine Beckett Griffith. And it's a 51 centimetre by 51, so a nice, decent size, this one. Um, faces... Is that meant to be furrer? One, three, two. Yeah, yeah. I can't pronounce that. There's certain words I really, really struggle with. But I'm looking forward to. I think I'm going to start that one. Maybe the start of November because I've got another Christmas one that I really want to start. I managed to snag this on eBay. Um, I've not tried Dreamer Designs, but I've opened it up and had a little look. The quality of the camera is beautiful. The only thing that I'd say is different is the felt on the back isn't as soft as the Diamond Dark Club. But I snagged this one for £45 and like £3 delivery. Uh, where's the picture of it? There it is, right at the end. So it's a Christmas house and this just reminded me of the house off Home Alone. And I thought, I've got to have it. For that price as well, I was really happy with paying for it for that, for that price. And this is a 31.5, no, 80... <laughs> Wishful thinking that, isn't it? 80 by 60 centimetres. And does it say on it? I'm pretty sure of it, that it's a square. I'm actually convinced that it's a square. It doesn't say anywhere on the box from what I remember in. It is a square, that one. Um, I'm not even seeing no more rounds now. Just looking. Yeah, there is no more rounds. So I think that was four rounds. And the rest are all square. <laughs> Uh, we've got Milky Way Galaxy and I purchased this one at the same time as the other Galaxy one that I'm working on and this is another big one uh, 56 by 76 so I just love like galaxies and stuff I do a lot of watercolour on my other channel like my own original uh, of watercolour I just love galaxies I just love galaxies uh, we'll save drawing until last day and then this one is a huge one I love the look of this one and I'm going to see, depending on how it turns out, if my husband will let me hang it in the bedroom. If not, it'll be that new Tiger one, but it might be a bit big for the bedroom. And it's a 70 by 96. 96. See, I do look at the uh, measurements when I'm shopping, but then my brain doesn't think that it's that big. And then when it turns up, I'm always like, oh my God, am I going to get through this? I do it every time. Every time with a big diamond painting without fail. So I'm looking forward to doing that one, it's more of a really realistic one. 
I did the exact same thing with this one. Tea party, it was on sale. Bought it. Didn't realise how big it was. A 70.89 times 89. And it's huge. And I've opened this up though and it's stunning. Stunning. This this might be another one that's added to the wall if I can make room somewhere. Uh, what else have we got? Uh, this one is an older. An older. I bought this one with a load of other handling ones that I've already completed and then they're done so you'll see them in another video but this one is Alice Lost and again this one's huge it's a 70 times 89 centimeters square again so yeah I think I've got four rounds out of all these I've got four rounds so I would like to I think the two new that are coming as well above square so I'm waiting for a really 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 good sale to come on I keep being told that the Black Friday seal, 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 why am I thinking about seals, I've just been watching TikTok, I bet you will come across a seal video, <laughs> uh, seal, sale video, um, I'm hoping for a good sale at Diamond Art Club, get my words out in the end won't I, um, and then I can take advantage and uh, stock up my rounds, but this one, Periton, isn't that a medicine? Am I pronouncing that wrong? <laughs> uh, yeah, it's that one. And I did get this. Um, I don't think it was discounted. I think I got it 20% off. And it's a 56 centimetre by 84. And again, this one looks just flipping beautiful. Beautiful. <laughs> and this one, I waited a long time. I say a long time, probably about three or four months for it to come back in stock and I was checking and checking and as soon as I got the notification I had to have it, just ordered this on its own, had to pay full price for it um, but I'm so glad that I've got it, I love it, if I could hang this in my bathroom I would but I can't, <laughs> it's what lies beneath and this is a 70 by 88, this might be the next one that I start possibly, ideally I want to do a round but we'll see it's just stunning and I have heard a rumour, I don't know whether it's true or not, that they're releasing some more of this, is it Dakota? Yeah, they're releasing more of their artwork which would be epic, epic. They're just going to sell out so quick though aren't they? Oh, right, the last one is my baby, Drogon. I will take this one out because I just want another leak. It's been a couple of months actually since I took it out. I've been recently drawing uh, Dragon Eyes as well. I'm just dragging, dragging mad clearly. I think what I'm going to do with this one, even though it is a square and my husband and my son uh, might not be happy about it, but I'm, <laughs> I'll have to do it on the dining table downstairs because it's way too big for this desk. Um, but I'm hoping that we can make it a little bit of a family thing, maybe a couple of hours of a weekend and we could work on it together. I mean, it, the, the canvas is big enough that that it, we could do that you know I could be working on the top right Louis can be on the bottom left you know and, and we can do it like that there's only 19 colours in this but I have seen it nearly finished on Instagram and it is incredible so I just want to show you actually how big this Game of Thrones one is with me holding it up you can see a couple of my finished diamond paintings there but yes um, it's as tall as me it's probably three quarters my length and i'm five foot five but look at the size of them honestly i cannot wait and it's going right there on the wall but i'm going to end this first video here thank you very very much for watching please do consider what today's oh no draw on draw on <laughs> please do consider subscribing to my new diamond painting channel i'm hoping to do uh regular uploads whipping chats kitten up Halls, small shop halls, uh, organisation, whatever, whatever. If you're interested in any, any of that, then please do leave me a comment down below. Leave you a comment. You know what? I've been filming and doing um, vlogs today, so I'm thinking that I'm talking like that. <laughs> please subscribe to my channel if you're new and hit the notification bell, and then you'll be notified whenever I do upload. So let's put this away. See this up on the wall, it'll be like a massive celebration. I better go because I will love keep her. Thanks so much for watching. Bye!